Hi, how you guys doing? This is Jonathan, and today we're going to feature these two pedals, these new pedals from NewX. We have the NewX Time Core Deluxe Mark II and the NewX Verb Core.
I want to thank Mong for Nuex for passing me these pedals for review. Fact is, he actually passed me a whole lot of pedals. Um, these are all the new ones that is from Nuex. You have the Loop Core um, Stereo. You have the Metal Core Deluxe Mark II. You have the Time Core Deluxe Mark II as well as the Verb Core Deluxe and the Mod Core Deluxe Mark II. Now, in the process of building my pedal board, the timing was just right uh, because this pedal just came in just nice and I needed a time uh, I needed time based units you know uh, effects and I was utilizing the time core the verb core as well as the mod core for for a while now you know and I think it works perfectly now um, from my experience after all these weeks this uh, tone master takes pedals really well and I was actually a little bit apprehensive about how it would handle uh, time-based units and I think it handled really really well uh, handled them really really well so these are the pedals that I use uh, when I'm using my pedal board with the M uh, when I'm doing my demos and whatever now the thing is that sometimes I don't use this uh, time-based units uh, because I wanted to tweak after I record so if I were to print all this then you know it's set in stone so sometimes I will use the uh, the delay and the revert from the helix native so that I can tweak after the fact you know what I mean but as effects by itself you know these are really great effects now let's just start with the time code deluxe basically you have like seven modes you know of delay you have the fill digital delay the analog delay modulation delay tape echo um, pan delay, uh, verb delay, reverse delay. Now, all these units, like for example, the um, the time core, the verb core, as well as the mod core, they can run in stereo if you choose to, meaning you can run to di two different amps. And when you have pan delay on your uh, time core, you know, you're going to pan left and right. So you're going to have that stereo effect. Um, really cool because you have adjustment for uh, your time signature like you know how you want your delay to bounce there is also tap tempo and there is a mix for you to decide how loud your delay is and then your repeat now the repeat uh, knob function as a tweak uh, at the same time as a tweak tool especially when you're going to um, presets like the uh, the mod delay for example you can kind of like tweak how much you want that modulation to be and also uh what you have the verb delay you know so verb delay means there is delay with reverb so you can kind of tweak this as to adjust how much reverb you want with your delay now there's also a mode called sos meaning sound on sound where it functions basically like a looper you know you can kind of like record about 40 seconds of uh, signal you know of a passage you want to and then you can play whatever you want on top of it just like a looper so on the top you have this uh dip switch where it gives you three position you know on the top uppermost you have the tail which is basically a buffer bypass uh, meaning your delay will spill over when you turn off the effect and then on the, on the middle you have the tone lock which i'll talk later and on the bottom you have the tb which is uh, true bypass um, the tone lock is really useful, especially when you're playing a club and then you, you know, when you see your customers or, you know, guys fooling and fooling around with your, with your effects, that tone lock will make sure that everything is locked in, all your settings have been done, it's been locked in. So it's really intuitive. Uh, once you locked in, there is a indication, a green light indication that it's been locked in so you can, you can do whatever you want, but the settings would not change. I think that is really, really great. Now again, um, you have a USB at the back where you can kind of like update the firmware if you choose to. It runs on a 9 volt power supply. Um, I have my Velcro on here, so it's a bit ugly, but you know, that's the way it is on a pedal board. So for the verb call, this is really interesting because you have again, uh, different presets. You have uh, all different types of reverb. You have the room, you have hall, uh, plate, damp, shimmering, spring, tremolo verb and modulation verb now of course you have a decay which decide how long you want your reverb to be you have the level how how long you want this effect to be and then you have this tweak knob which is really useful like for example on some of the reverb like this the uh, plate and you can kind of adjust uh, the tone and how you want that reverb to sound little little uh, stuff but when it comes to the tremolo reverb as well as the modulation reverb 
you can kind of adjust the speed of the tremolo, um, how much modulation you want with your reverb. So it's pretty interesting. You can have a kind of a mix there. Now, again, uh, New X has made it in such a way where if you hold down this button, you, you know, if you play a chord and you hold out this button, that chord will just ring and then you can kind of play other stuff on top of it if you want to, which I think is really useful if you're doing a solo segment. Um, really useful when it comes to that, you know. So cool, um, great uh, nifty little pedal again. USB for firmware as well as a nine volt power supply. You have stereo in and stereo out. Now, like I said, all these units, the um, verb core, the time core, as well as the mod core, they can all be run in true stereo if you choose to. Now, uh, I tried running it through my 2M, um, it, it gets kind of a little bit uh, complicated, so I gave up on it. And whatever you're hearing on that song is just mono. There is no reverb from the Helix Native, no delay from the Helix Native. What you ever delay you hear is all in mono, and they are all from these two units with the amp. Uh, they are really good hardy pedals, really nice looking. In fact, I think the design for uh, the boxes and in the internal, you know, they comes in, they, they come in with a little nice envelope with your manual as well as a sticker and, and whatnot. So the packaging has changed, um, really nice. And um, design too, you know, really uh, pleasing to the eye. And hardy, you know, road, road worthy. So this, these pedals are, affordable they are not terribly expensive and they, they do this work you know if you're looking for a real nice uh, reverb as well as a delay you know these are the ones that you can go for all right uh, let me know what do you think about this uh pedals and uh, leave your comments in the comment section down below now the pedals are available in all places that carry new x products so i do not know where you are from so it would be good to check out uh, where whether they do sell uh new x products in your favorite stores all right so if you like this video give me a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel press that bell for notification of future videos that follow and be part of the patrons to support this channel i would appreciate it i thank all my patrons for the wonderful love the wonderful support thank you so much guys so in the meantime you guys take care of yourself and i'll see you real soon ciao